Hey guys, Isa Tempest here. Today I want to talk about three things that I would change in CSGO that won't change the current game flow that we have right now. First off, I want to talk about smoke inconsistencies. If you don't know that the smoke is currently running as a client side, which means that the base of it will always be the same, where it lands will be the same, but the sides here, this, like, uh, what you call it, good graphics, uh, maybe, um, is client sided. That means that it's inconsistent. So we can do one way smokes like Drawing here smoke. and look down long. And I can see my enemy, but they can't see me uh, because I'm hiding in the inconsistency. And the further away we come from the inconsistency, the more difficult it will be to see. So you can you can use these in many different spots. Um, you can cover short simply by putting smoke here. And you can see them as they come out short. This will probably only work with an op. But you will be able to see them and they can't see you in any way. These are the smokes that I want to like destroy one way smoke wise. Um, they are built on inconsistencies and I don't like it. It takes out the skill of the game. From over here you can throw a one way smoke here that I will actually accept. Uh, because it's not because of inconsistency we have a one way smoke. But because of a certain angle. This is because it's higher and I can see their feet. You can actually sort of counter this. So if you come here and you see this, you don't run here. It's like suicide. We'll have to peek it slowly to see where the gap is. So, the second thing I want to change is the Deagle. Uh, I like the fact that it's a skill cannon. Uh, it in one shot to the hit in all ranges, uh, regardless of armor. But I don't like that you can actually move and be pretty accurate with it. So, let's say that there's a player here, and this thing here is his head. That's too close. I'm not letting go, just keep on going. It's... This is too close. And if you consider, like, just my player model. How many? One, two, three, four? That would hit. That's that. So, the third thing I want to change is the pistol versus rifle gun balance. As we know right now, the M4 does 91 damage up close. Full frontal. P250 does more damage to hit armor, which means it actually does over 100, which means I can headshot my opponent in one shot close range. But if you have an M4, you're dead. If you both hit a headshot, the M4 will be dead. I'm gonna show you a clip where I'm actually gonna come in and attack a guy right here in close combat with the P250. So I do know I hit him before I actually headshot him, but this proves the point of running gun with the P250, the Tech 9, whatever, 57. All of these buy guns are actually viable for running gun. And I've thought about how we could like balance this out, but the closest thing that I have got is that we actually above the close range damage of the M4s. So they would deal like 106 damage in completely close range, like four or five meters maybe. Uh, let me know what you think about this or the other things that I have discussed in this video. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.